Hello, all you imps, pixies, and other fine fae folk. It's me, Michelle, the Hobby Hobbit. This is a channel where we play with different kinds of arts and craftsy things, but we are master of none. To those of you who have just wandered across my channel, I would love it if you would consider giving me a like and a subscribe. It helps my baby channel grow. To those of you who have come back after subscribing, hi. How are you? How you doing? Welcome back. Right, got a list of things in my description box, different links, different um, items I like, channels that I'd love for you to consider supporting, and channels that inspire me. I also have some favorites of mine. Erin at My Scrap Cabin Shop is giving a 10% discount to my subscribers with the code HOBBIT10, H-O-B-B-I-T-10. Now do keep in mind, if there is already a discount that is greater than my 10%, don't use my code because it's going to change the pricing that's already set for that higher discount. So just throwing that out there. Um, Fabi Art Studio has beautiful printables. The Junk Journal Studio has the sweetest little labels. And Vintage Paper by Design, that is June. She is giving a 50% off of all of her stock except for the um, the the pre-packaged mystery stamp boxes. Those are a flat $75. That includes the shipping. There are 28 stamp sets in them plus eight or nine. I can't remember what she said, eight or nine stamp and die sets. I actually bought one of the boxes off of her because I really like her stuff. She's got, I mean, 30 years worth of stamps and stuff that she's trying to downsize from her shop. She used to make a lot of cards and now she's more into journaling supplies. So she's kind of getting rid of some of her stuff. Um, that code is Xmas50, X-M-A-S-50 for 50% 50 off of everything except for those mystery stamp boxes. And because they are a mystery stamp box, she is not showing what's inside them. I can tell you I've done a little bit of a, a show for what I got from her and um, I, I like it. I like it. So I'm just kind of throwing that stuff out there. Right. So we're going to continue on with Melissa Sue's journal and we are going to do some stamped inspirational prompts, words, and things. So I'm just going to use these fun colors that we already have out to stamp onto some plain uh, cardstock. It's manila cream colored. Um, just a set that I got from Michael's that has a bunch of different colors, and that's what I'm going to use today. I have a bunch of different um, letter stamps that we're going to look at using. Um, so we can just have a little bit of a play day, yeah? Okay, so this one is going to be, uh, let's do Journey. I'll worry about stamping these straight in a second. I just wanted to make sure I had all the letters. Okay. J. Okay, we're going to get these as straight as we can. Hang on. I'm going to have to look at that before I stamp it because that may be backwards. That E may be upside down. Let's look at that journey. Nope, that looks good. They're a little, it's a little wibbly wobbly, but I can't get it much straighter than that. I mean, truthfully, I'm, I'm surprised I got it that straight. We all know I can't draw a straight line, cut a straight line. Okay, this one I feel like we want to do red as her signature color. So we're going to do this candy red. A 
love it. Okay, what else can we do? What's another word we can do? Um, Jeffy, why are you crying? What's the matter, buddy? Um, um, I can't do some of the words I want to do because they require multiple letters. I guess I could do them one at a time. Um, Not so sure I like this one because it seems to be pressing harder. Maybe I'm pressing too hard. I don't want to change that from inspire to inspired by. No, I think I'm just going to leave it as inspire. Um, let's put these aside for now. Oh, let's do... I'm going to use the, do the word beauty on this one. Yeah, because there's beautiful things everywhere that we get inspired by, right? Be. Oh, this is sadly going down in the line. Downhill. Oh, it is so hard to get a straight line. And then we've got grids on this. Good grief, you guys. We even have grid work to follow it by. Let's try it again, P.E. Okay. That's a bit better. That's going better. I think. Yeah, 
that's much better. Okay, I think purple, wilted violet, Oh, come on. Okay, well, we're going to try and hit that A back up. I think I know what the problem is. I've got that dip here, and it's not leaning right. There we go. Fixed it. Um, we're going to use the word brave. All right, let me get these kind of put back where they need to go. did say that I wanted to go ahead and stamp these too. So let's go ahead and grab the ones that we did not do and stamp some of those. Um, Of permission. Focus on the good.
own your dreams. Like that one a lot. I think we all need to learn this one. Stop overthinking. Be fearless. Blessed are the curious. Oh, should I leave that? Do I allow myself to have that mistake? Any other time I would say it's a junk journal. It doesn't matter. Junk journals aren't supposed to be perfect. But this is a gift. Blessed are the curious. Love with all your heart. And see what I like about these are some of these are going to force Melissa to think outside of the box. They're going to force her to think about things that like lost and found. It could be that, you know, a lost memory that going through this journal you found again. Love you. I need another orange. Oh, and I need green. Hello there is definitely going to force her to think outside the box because that could be, you know, talking about a friend that you haven't seen in a long time, that maybe you should try to reach out to them because they came across your mind while you were thinking about this. You do you. Collect beautiful moments. Love that. Let's try to do a yellow. This mustard yellow. Lucky is a state of mind. Be you, the world will adjust. I love that too. That could spark a memory of when she didn't feel so included in something. Who knows? It could be a moment when 
she did something that she wouldn't normally have done and it turned out great if not now then when seriously guys if not now when Believe in yourself. Mm. Hope is never lost. Start somewhere. That's perfect for a journal prompt. I think that should be the first page. What's this one say? Best day ever. You are enough. Let's try to get that way on there. That just boogered it up. Okay. Free stamp. Shine brightly. Okay. I am completely ink and oxide covered now. All right, let me grab a wet wipe. Okay, it's mostly clean. Okay, I've just lost that. Right, so let's go ahead and get some of these cut out and then we'll do like, as I need more prompts and things, we'll, or as I think of more prompts, we'll start listing them and doing them, yeah? These are gonna just be simple. I'm just gonna cut them as straight as I can. It's gonna be super simple to do. Or well, not super simple to do, but it's gonna be a simple, super simple thing. They're not going to be any fancy designs. 
nothing super fancy just a little cut cut okay admittedly this is a shorter video than what you guys are used to but this is what we have stamped yeah i'm gonna go ahead and cut these out you guys don't need to see me do that and i will see you next time until then bye, -bye.